Constructing your life is about much more than just building a bank account. Each week, join real estate entrepreneur and mindset coach Austin Linney as he interviews guests who are constructing their dream lives and impacting the world around them on a daily basis. If you're an entrepreneur or wanting to start a business, or you just want to hear motivating stories of how others have overcome the odds, you are in the right place. And now for your host, Austin Linney. Guys, welcome back to Construct Your Life. This is Austin Lenny here with your Friday rant. And a word I'm going to use today is maybe not the word we'll talk about, but maybe it's a word that matters more of a phrasing, kind of an ideology, we'll say, is roller coaster. You know, a lot of us say we want the roller coaster. We ask for the roller coaster. And then when the roller coaster appears, we're upset that the roller coaster is a roller coaster. It's only acting that way because it's that item or that person or that thing's nature to behave that way. It's like being mad at the color yellow because it's yellow. And as you swim, as you level up your business, as you move into deeper waters with more money, you're swimming with some sharks. And then we get all butthurt and we get all tied up in a tizzy when the sharks bite back. Isn't that what you asked for in the first place? Didn't you want to level up? Didn't you want to make more money? Didn't you want to make the stakes higher? And then we're upset when it gets a little dicey. Think about that for a minute. You get what you asked for in this world. So it's as simple as that. But yeah, here we are bitching and moaning and complaining. It doesn't turn out the way we wanted it to. Or that thing or that person is behaving in the exact nature of who they are. So the question that you have to ask yourself is why is it triggering you? Or does it say about you? Because don't get it twisted. The only way I got sober, the only way that I've been able to move forward in my life was extreme ownership. So regardless of any situation that happens, regardless of whatever the hell you want to call it, either your client's wrong or that real estate agent's wrong or your spouse is wrong or your family member, but you have to understand that you played a part in there somewhere. So I'm far more concerned about what you're reacting to than what's being directed towards you. Does that make sense? We are who we are. They are acting the way that they've acted. And so your belief that they should act somewhere different is you putting false expectations on somebody and then being disappointed. You have to operate in this world as if you have no expectations of anybody. Nobody owes you anything. They don't owe you a proper reaction. They don't owe you to be nice, but you have a choice. You can get upset at the roller coaster or you can jump the fuck on and smile and laugh and laugh at yourself for being triggered and jump on that bad boy and ride it. Life is meant to be have fun. We're so damn serious. So maybe every now and then, you got to swim with a shark. Maybe every now and then, you got to paint outside the lines. Maybe every now and then, you just got to get on the fucking roller coaster and surrender. Because I promise you, if you do, it'll be a lot more fun. I hope everybody got some value from this, and we'll see you next time.
Thank you for listening to Construct Your Life with Austin Lenny. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to rate, review, subscribe, and pay it forward by sharing with a friend. Most importantly, take this opportunity to start constructing your life by taking immediate action on what you learned. For show notes, resources, and more information on one-on-one coaching with Austin, visit constructyourlifepodcast.com.